So in this video, I'm going to teach you how to download um, the two important softwares that we're going to need to install Raspberry Pi um, operating system. So the first um, components that we actually need is um, the SD card. As you can see, that's a 32 gig SD card. We need to work with it. Of course, you're going to need an SD card um, reader here. So all I'm going to do is to insert this into it. So after inserting this into this, I'm going to plug on my laptop. So I'm going to be plugging this on my laptop. So after plugging this on my laptop, I know I'm ready to um, write an operating system on the SD card. So uh, let's first of all download the software that we need. So we're going to need a Raspberry Pi Imager. So the Raspberry Pi Imager is a software that looks like this that we're going to be using. So um, because I'm working with Windows on my system, I'm going to um, I'm going to first of all download for Windows. So when you click download for Windows, instantly it begins to download. Already I have it, so I don't need to download it anymore. Just know the 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 URL raspberrypi.org slash software slash. So when you come here, you can see install Raspberry Pi OS using Raspberry Pi Imager. So you can download for Windows. Okay, the second software we need is the operating system itself. So to get the operating system, all you need is to click on download Raspberry Pi desktop. When you click on it, it takes you to this page where you can download for PC and Mac. So if you're using, um, so if you if you want to download it, all you need is look at it, Debian Broster with Raspberry Pi desktop. Release date January 11th, 2021, and the kernel version is 4.19. Currently, the size is 2.9 uh, gig. You know, 2.9 for it. So you can just click on download and it begins to download. So I already have mine. I don't need to download it. So these are the two areas where you can get the, um, the, the softwares. First of all, um, know the URL. This is this URL enables you get the operating system itself. Why you, can, you get the image here? Okay. So after downloading them, the first thing you're going to do is to install. The imager, look at my imager here. So when you double click on it, then yes, so you can begin your installation. So I already have uh, imager installed before, so I'm just going to run it. So the moment it opens, the first thing uh, I'll do is uh, to choose, it says choose SD card, so I'm going to click on it. Can you see? has detected my SD card already mass storage device USB device 32 gig so that's my SD card the next thing to do is to choose the operating system so because my operating system is already downloaded on my laptop so I'm going to click on use custom here so I click on it currently is on my uh, currently is on my documents I have a folder called um, Raspberry Pi, you can see software, that's it here. So you just click on write. It says all existing data on mass storage device, USB because we raised. Are you sure you want to continue? Yes, of course, you want to continue. So it has started writing. So um, it's going to take a little time depending on how fast your system is. So let's see how long it's going to take. So it's currently writing. Currently it's on 4%, 5% uh, now. So it's increasing.
So we are done. So we close. And that's it.